Hey everyone, Merrick here, and this is Kin Follett's The Pillars of Earth, or Pillars of the Earth from the Ashes. This is book one of a trilogy brought to you by the good folks at Diabolic Entertainment. I'm pretty sure I butchered that, but I don't care because we're going to get into this. This is the same publisher that brought you um, Fire that we had what, last week, week before last, something like that. Week before last, that's what it was. So let's get into it. It's another point and click adventure. Do I want to play the tutorial? Yes, I do. I'm in the cathedral. Walk by left clicking where you want to go. Okay. This has a much more somber tone than, um, than fire, which was obviously silly. Okay. When it changes, right click multiple times to think about the object. Masterfully classed. Sally knows what she's doing. Strange when your children surpass you. I'm sorry, what? To see objects and characters, objects, characters, and exits you can interact with, hold the mouse wheel. Or press and hold space bar. Oh. Tools. Okay. I have tools. Let me tweak my microphone setup here. There we go. It's coming through a little quiet, and I'm not sure why. Take those tools. Uh, your inventory displays at the bottom of your screen. You can select. Okay. That's normal. The animations on this are fantastic. Oh. Quick time events. Oh, those are going to be my downfall. Ah, oh, hello! I can talk to Sally, my daughter, as stubborn as me, and as stubborn as her mother, my daughter. Okay, those are all his thoughts on her. Um, left click to choose your answer. Later in the game, you can also skip lines of dialogue by left clicking. Wave to get your daughter's attention. Cough to you. A little wave. Oh. If you want to stay silent, wait for the timer to run out. No talking? I guess because we're in the cathedral, there's no talking, huh? Maybe. I don't know. I have a follower now. Um, exit. You want to think about it? No. Okay. I was trying to see what he thought about the exit. Like, it's a grand exit or door. Shuring, England. Shiring? Shuring? I don't know. 11.53. I believe that your clock is wrong. It's only 7.19. <laughs> I'm sorry, 19.19? 19. 24 hour clock. Thank y'all. Digging in the dirt. Oh, she's preggers. Oh, this should do. How do you feel? Oh, can't complain. After all, there's a cozy tree in my back. Oh, I promise. This will be the last fire. After tonight, it won't be trees anymore, but walls and a roof. In Shiring, I will find a job. What if the bishop wants to hire you for life? To keep his palace in shape? Maybe strengthen the town's defenses? Plain things, Tom Builder. Just walls and roofs. Well, what if? You gonna answer the woman? There. Took me a lifetime to find some dry ones in this wet. Why didn't we just use your staff? 
That old thing would have done nicely. Because that thing is precious. It's not made to burn. It's a measuring staff. And we might be able to sell it. Right, now let's see if this does the trick. Well, you just, just gonna blow on your hand like that? Let's have, let's have some thoughts, shall we? No. All I need is a few good sparks. Flint and steel should do the trick. It's good that I always have some with me. All right. Let's, let's get to work. Yep. That's not an appropriate way to do that. You should be building a little log cabin with your tinder underneath it, and then your sparks. Martha. Yeah. You want to cut up some turnips? We'll be making soup. Mm, if it helps. It does, you little shit. Alfred. Where'd you get that? You turnip? go look for water. We could just eat snow. No, it'll be proper water for my family. You sit. I'll take care of it. You little shit. You still haven't answered my question, Tom Builder. What if the bishop offered you a job like they did in Exeter? Something that is beneath your craft, but pays for a lifetime. Easy work. Well, building something is never easy. You know what I mean. After Exeter, you said I could create something that matters. Something that stands for eternity. Or I could die setting up houses and sheds. But what if houses and sheds would feed your family? Would you stay this time? Or would you keep on looking? Oh. Oh. Family. I'd be glad to stay. Would you now? Just promise me you'll think about it. I need to find some proper water. A clue. You just collected a clue. Clues work like items. Use them as a character to talk about them. Use them on objects to ponder how the clue and the object might be connected. Alright. Maybe we can sell the baby. Alfred! <laughs> I'm joking. Don't listen to me. <laughs> I mean, you can get a dollar for it. Just what I need. Yeah? Our last pot. I need it for water. Our last pot. I'll need it for water. One of the last things we haven't had to sell yet. Dude, you should take a steady job. Stupid snow. Why did it have to come down just now? I don't know. Should never have left. Well, we're here now. Guess there's no it's use the first tool go. one would need to build a new church. Used to make sure the construction faces east. Its wood has withered, but it would still do the deed. If I ever get to use it again, that is. All right. Oh, stomach grumbles. Hungry? I'm fine. Yeah, she's a trooper. I'm looking for water, kiddos. Into the forest. Deep in the woods of Carnegie Hall. Pesky little beasts. I have to stay away from our camp. A frozen puddle of water. That is there better than that. But if we cook it, it'll be fine. Mm. Plain snow. Dirty with crow muck. There must be something better. Don't think I want to settle for that. We got we got a babby. Rock. Strong granite. If broken down, it probably could make these wonderful port uh, portices. Or just plain boring door. Okay. We're still doing that. Don't want any bushes. Nah. No getting through there. Okay. Deeper into the forest. I don't know what the consequences of, of going deeper are. Like, am I going to get my kids killed because I won't settle? Uh, it's just more woods down that way. Okay. Did I go the wrong way? Let's see if there's another way to to go. I don't want to clip that. Still working on the water, babe. Don't worry about it. I got you. Well, where'd the little gutter snipe come from? Can I get a job when we arrive in Shiring? Yes. You're a little girl. You can all shut help. up. Everybody works. All right. Well, they get a frozen puddle. <coughs> uh. 
too hard for my fist, but my pot should break it. Or your pot will break. Houses and sheds. Walls and roofs. I'd be glad. I should be glad. Yeah, you should. What's going on? Oh, he's seeing greatness in his mind. Mom, what's keeping you? Tom, what's keeping you? That should do. Okay. Oh man, I don't want to come back to the family to be dead. I have no idea if it's a game that that's morbid. Uh, that is that morbid, but we'll see. Okay, they're not dead. Alright. As long as they're not dead. That's our last pot. Be careful with it. Well, I just used it to smash, uh... To smash some ice. So Instead of the hammer in my belt. You know. Because I'm... I'm smart like that. I'm real smart. Is it water yet? Um, did you think about what I asked you? I did. Dreaming of building a cathedral was foolish. When we get to Shiring, I'll take the job. Why is a cathedral so special? Well, Glory. you've seen a few. You should know. Yes, but there are so many already. Why do you have to build another one? Is it because God needs more houses? <laughs> May I? If you must. Well. Actually, a cathedral isn't so different from any other house. It always starts simple, with some walls. And on top of that, you put a roof. Very good. A roof to keep off the rain, and walls to keep up the roof. Together that makes one big, long, but dark room. Like a cave. <laughs> oh, that's cool. That's so cool. Now, we mustn't forget the doors. And not only doors, but a big and impressive one to let in as many people as possible. But isn't it still dark in there? It is. So what do you suggest? So, what do you suggest? Windows, of course. Yeah! Right. So the people inside can see what they're doing. By now, we've carved quite a few holes in our cathedral. Unfortunately, not every building can carry a roof like that and have so many windows. So what do we do? Good and solid work. That's what we do. Yeah. If we don't want our cave to collapse, we have to make everything perfect. Not only strong, but consistent and perfectly even. The walls, the roof, the windows, everything. Perfectly proportioned. You shouldn't say big words like proportioned when talking to a child. What does it mean? It means beauty. Well, it means not only will it keep them dry, uh, it'll give him hope. It will give them hope. Agnes? <laughs> Mama? Agnes about to let out a baby poo. Oh, uh, that's not good. That's a breach. Or some other baby term. The baby is coming. But blood is not a good thing to have. But it's not due. Have your waters broken yet? Soon after we started walking this morning. What? You should have told me. Yeah. I'm so tired. I don't believe I can bring it into the world. Agnes? Well, look at all the blood. <laughs> uh. I'm almost as scared as I am. Uh... Right, what 
can I do to help? Cover me. Will, will she die? She'll die, right? Shut up, Alfred. <laughs> Mama. You little shit. Stop saying things like that. Warn them for you. No. Stay here. Please. This sucks. Um. What else can I do? Give the children something to do. I um. Children. Children. Alfred. Alfred. Build a bigger fire. Go and collect more wood. Let's have a bigger fire. More wood? I can do it. Let me. Alfred. Alfred is faster. He has to do it. But I want to help too. I'll give you a job. Don't you worry, Martha. Uh, I need you to remain said staff. We're gonna need some reeds. Collect some reeds and make me two lengths of string, each big enough for a necklace. What for? You'll see. You gotta bundle the baby. Good girl. Alright. Uh, hold on, look around. Can I take my jacket off? Oh, no, that's, that's the options menu. They won't let me do anything there. Um, what else can I do? What else can I do? Oh, that's not good. I put more wood on the fire. Thank you. you. Feel the warmth. Yes. Good. Um. Alfred. Get some warm water. Get more water. Take snow if you must, and make it warm. Right. Where is Martha? Uh. Remember when Martha was born, and the Lady Isabella acted as midwife. You were building a chapel, and you asked her to send her maid to fetch the midwife from the village. And she said, that drunken old witch <laughs> will let her deliver a literal wolfhound pups. And she took us to her own chamber, and poor Lord Robert could not go to bed until Martha was born. It's not long now. Be ready. All right, where's my glove? Where's my catcher's mitt? Um, hold her. <sighs> Sorry. I'm here with you. Yeah. I know. Love. It's cold. Um. I'd say for a year as bad as this one, we've managed quite well. You lost your work. And then Martha almost got killed by that pig thief. Oh. You call that well? Oh no. But we're still here for each other, aren't we? Holding together as a family. Yeah. Us builders aren't carved out of measly wood. Never were. You expect a lump of granite to come falling from my legs? <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> the water's warm now. Put it next to me. Where's your sister? It's coming! Help me, Tom! There's your sister. Okay, I didn't want her to die. It's coming. I can see it. I hope I did the right thing. I hope I did. I hope I did good. We got a baby. Horrible. Well, He's perfect. A perfect boy. It's a baby, but there's a lot of blood. I don't think she's gonna make it. You're still bleeding. It's all right. It will stop soon. She's gonna die. Oh. Tom. What? Yes? Thank you for being my midwife. Anytime, baby. Anytime. You remember the night I came to you? In your lodge? When you were working on my father's church? Of course. How could I ever forget? I never regretted giving myself to you. Never. For one moment. Every time I think of that night, I feel so glad. Me too. 
Oh. She's about to close her eyes for the last time. I hope you build your cathedral. I thought you were against it. I was. But I was wrong. You deserve something beautiful. I have you. Build a beautiful cathedral. Her eyes Maybe. are getting worse. Yep. Papa, what's wrong with her face? Agnes. Agnes, wake up. Alfred, take the baby. Give the baby to Alfred and see if you can help her. That was just the intro. God damn it, I'm all misty eyed. Oh. Oh, this is gonna be a fucking dark game. Oh man. This one's gonna be heavy, guys. This, this one is not like fire. If you catch my drift. There's an actual book. I didn't know that. Now I want to read the book. Thank you, Tilo, for the awesome music. Okay, look at these great animations. You guys did an amazing job. Also, I like that there was a plane flying by in the, st the stock footage they used for the clouds. <laughs> yeah, you kind of can't stop that, but it happens. Oh, man. This game is just going to, it's going to kill my heart, isn't it? Um, this is the prologue. <laughs> okay. You want your cathedral to bring hope? You told Agnes you would accept any job offered by the bishop. You struggled to support Agnes during childbirth. How did I struggle? I asked a bunch of questions, but I, I told the kids what to do. I have never given baby birth before. <laughs> Shut up. You're judging. Agnes. I wonder if you could have saved her. I don't know, that was a lot of blood in the beginning. Philip! Philip D'Souza. Nice to meet you. God, this game is beautiful. The year of our Lord, 1135, had come to an end. King Henry of England, son of William the Conqueror, had died. It was a time of poverty and death. In their despair, some had come to believe Christ and all his saints had gone to sleep. And that the pillars of the earth themselves had begun to crumble. Stroke the pony. Is there no one to welcome us? Who goes there? Bob. You just crossed the bridge, right? Mm-hmm. What about it? Got a problem with it? I'll pop you one. That'll be a farthing for you and a penny for your horse. Excuse me? Monks and villagers don't have to pay a toll. Ah, sorry, I'm not good at this. I told Brother Paul. It's not easy doing the Lord's work when you're hungry. Offer cheese. It is not much, but I can share this with you. Fishing in the winter is not going to be easy, by the way. Are you sniffing it? You douche. I 
I give you my food and you just sniff it and make a face? Fuck you. I hope now it will be easier for you to fulfill your duties. Oh, I'm sure it will. Mm hmm Will you take care of my horse, brother? I have come to see Prior James. Prior James? That's him the bells are tolling for. Oh, shit. Leave the horse here. I'll, I'll get it down to the Priory later. The fish should go nicely with that cheese. What? Why are they ringing the bells? Because he's dead. Don't you know? The devil has come to Kingsbridge. What? The devil has come to Kingsbridge? My horse is just like, yeah, man. Don't you know? Philip's Bible. You can use Philip's Bibles on objects to find out what the Bible tells Philip's about them. Or use it on people to discuss matters of faith. Toll Hut. Usually Brother Paul sits here. Where is Paul? I wonder where Paul is. Whoever is righteous has regard for the life of his beast. Where'd that little shit go? This neglect will be a burden on the Priory's coffers. A shameful waste. Yeah, they should probably fix that bridge. Bridge is in bad shape. Neglect took its toll, soon beyond repair. Far away from the Shiring. Nobles come only on holidays. Wouldn't come if it wasn't for the cathedral. What do you say about it? It was built for the glory of God. Mm -hmm. I fear a priory this size might corrupt even a humble prior's heart. Hmm. Oh, I was trying to get him to be like, The cheesecloth is made of cheese, which is holy to the Lord of Cheese. Oh, wait, hold on. No, no, we're not done. Priory takes fish from the river. The river moves the Priory's mills. The river carries away the Priory's waste. By the breath of God, ice is given. The broad waters are frozen fast. By the breath of God, ice is given, and the broad waters are frozen fast. God, that voice sounds so familiar. Order my steps in thy word, and let not any iniquity have dominion over me. Order my step, and let not... Uh, remember not to stray f right from the path. Bad feeling about this. I pray it was an animal. Oh, somebody fell into the ice or something. My question is um is that Sean Bean? Cuz it sounds like Sean Bean's voice. I didn't get a starring, at least I didn't pay attention to a starring, so I'm curious. And we're going over to the the mill here. There's some sheepies. They let the old mill fall apart. Now they pay for using the one next to the village. Why? The Lord has given them plenty, and they let it go to waste. The Lord and they let. But why? I mean, seriously, why? Why would you have your own mill and then just let it go? And then rent another mill. Why is this locked? I don't know. Bad things are happening. Shabby manger, waste of cloth, at least fresh hay. Something about Jesus. And to every beast of the earth. And to every bird of the heavens, and to everything that creeps on the earth, everything that has the breath of life, I have given every green plant for food. And it was so. Uh, not all green plants are food, but... Alright. If you, if you want to go that way, you can't eat everything. Some of it's medicine, some of it's poison. Go to the cloister. Oh. When he opened the sixth seal, I looked, and behold, there was a great earthquake. And the door to the front of the cathedral, to Milo's Cuthbert's kitchen. The moon became like blood, and 
Winter has taken its toll. Planting seeds is like training a novice. Great things will come of it. Slight entrance to the cathedral. I prefer this one to the front gate. It's more humble. The earth brought forth vegetation, plants yielding seed according to their own kind. And God saw that it was good. All right. No religious blather on the door? Ah, uh, there we go. Enter by the narrow gate. For the gate is narrow and the way is hard that leads to life. And those who find it are few. All right, well, this game is going to be real heavy. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I can't wait to get deeper into it if you did enjoy it. Um, click the like button, share some support. If you have any comments, suggestions, no spoilers, please, throw them in the comment section below. And, of course, if you enjoyed this and you haven't subscribed, consider clicking this good old subscribe button and YouTube will let you know when uh, we get fresh content out. All that being said, I'll see you next time.